Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome to another vlog, 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 vlog. So, what we got going on here? I'm here in my storage unit. Just wanna show you guys what's in my storage unit. I haven't been here for a while. 79, that's my football number. So, that was great getting that, you know what I'm saying? Alright, let's pop that lock off. This ain't no store drawers today, guys. I do, and I have done store drawers. Let's pop it off. Let's see what crazy stuff's in here. Oh, not too shabby. Get that dust. Come out of here. I got another door I could open up. I don't know if you can see. Look at that sick chest, bro. Gotta fix that buddy up, dude. Let's see what else is in here, guys. We got like a, it's called a, it's like a futon, but it's called like, a, it's called a click clack. Got some tables over there. Got like a screen machine thingamajigger. Um, oh, look at that. Good old heat press. Make some t-shirts. We got one of my tailgates. Um, that sign right there, that's an air trans sign. Yeah, like airlines, it's out of business. Uh, that big round thing over there is uh, some glass for my, a glass table on mine. So we got carts, bro. Look at those beautiful carts, man. Got them from my buddy. We got t-shirts in here, dude. T-shirts that I've created over the years. If you guys want to buy some, dude, let me know. Uh, and more t-shirts. Oh, we got a saddle in here. Hold on here. Let me put this on my shoulder. Oh, no, that box is gonna... I got a saddle in there. So what's in there is a saddle. Uh, it's an old baby. Uh, we got another, like, chest type thing here. It's, it's not a chest. It's like more like a... Put tools. It's probably what... Back in the war days or something, you know. Who knows? A bowling ball. Uh, this thing is a TV stand. You guys want a TV stand? <laughs> what else we got in here? I th I got like some speaker. I got some home system. Oh, look at this thing here. This thing here. This I've never used this, but this thing's supposed to be legit. The portable fridge and warmer dude I've never used it I've always wanted to use it just haven't used it yet yeah well all right this is probably the worst position you will see this but see right there that the 1940s radio still works it's in nice condition it just you just seen it um, kind of in an odd spot <laughs> uh, it used to be in a box, so I don't know what happened to that, but yeah. Anyway, uh, if you like my storage unit, let me know. Uh, should probably get rid of this couch or something. I got this for free. One of the neighbor's storage units uh, didn't want theirs. And I end up, uh, I got it for free, you know. So, I can sell it for probably a good 200 bucks. Really, nothing's wrong with it. Just on the back side, uh, there's something wrong. There's like a little tear. You could probably sew it up, you know. <clears throat> but, all right, guys. Well, thanks for hanging out here at my storage unit. Just wanted to stop by. Haven't been here for a while. Probably a few months ever since I got the thing. Or, or longer. <laughs> uh, we got a couple of lights up in here. Got a storage. Now, I don't pay. I, I live in California, so, you know. I mean, it, th th this place is, I mean, this is how big the unit is, guys. You get, you get this space here, and then you get this space here. Um, and, you know, it's, just, it's not that much, but it's like, uh, it's a hundred bucks for this unit. And in 
you go to uh, the Bay Area, oh yeah, you'd be paying easy 500 bucks for this. <laughs> um, easy. So, yeah, this isn't cheap, but it's better than nothing. I've I had a small, the smallest unit I ever even seen. Well, okay, maybe not the ever seen, but okay. So, like one of these doors, one of these doors here, uh, about that size, coming all the way until right here. That, like, so you have from this to right here. And that was about over, that was 130 bucks in in the in the city. So <clears throat> getting this whole unit for 100 bucks, I'd say, hey, you know, what? it's I should probably use it to the max. I mean, you can stack you can stack some nice stuff up there. But if you guys got any like stuff that you want to hook up with me, you know, I can I can store some stuff too. You know, it's all good. Um, so uh, my tailgate, you're probably like, well. Where's your tailgate? You know, why you got your tailgate here? Well, you notice that this tailgate doesn't have the equipment on it. Well, I got that for free because someone hit me. Uh, I what I did? I took my old tailgate and put it back on my truck. This is my old tailgate, guys. Here's my truck, guys. I don't know if you ever seen my truck. Look at those pretty rims. And get some better tires. My tires. Uh. Uh. This one's an old one. But no, no more original tires that I had before. You like that? Is that is that you like that truck? I don't know. I'm looking to get a bigger truck. Here's my tailgate, guys. You can look at my license plate. Yeah, it's fine. Got one with six boys, guys. Look at that. Go get your one with six boys license plate today, guys. Are you following Jesus this close? One. Triple eight, need him, guys. You can call or text. You don't have to just call. You can text as well. And you can also go to chataboutjesus.com. I got a dent right there. Someone hated me because of my Jesus thing. It's all good. Oh, there we got some shine of those that tire there a little bit. Not bad. You like you like those rims, guys? 2010 rims there. My hood got kind of messed up with some I don't know stuff like bird junk, I guess. My license plate ain't too clean on this side, but <clears throat> oh, and then my antenna. That's uh, taking some hits because of uh, that Jesus t tailgate. Uh, obviously, used to be straight. Someone uh, bent it down. I bent it back up, and they bent it down. I was like, "Oh, cool! They actually make things like this, but it's like rubber, I guess. I don't know." So, let me know what you think of my truck. It's actually kind of small for me. I I got it because you know, uh, to be a gas saver in the long run. But actually, I was looking for a, a V6. This is a, a four-cylinder, but. I wanted to get a V6 at the time, but I didn't want to get a brand new truck. Was well, and that was December of 2007. Um, and yeah, anyway, I uh, ended up getting an 08, and because I, I like the color, this is my color, you know. So I ended up going with it. Uh, I took, you know, I might not fit in it too well, uh, a little too tall for it, you know. But uh, I want to go get, I want to go look at some trucks, you know, like. There's a couple trucks I was looking at. Uh, it's uh, they're about fifty <laughs> fifty five thousand dollars. Crazy. All right, so this obviously is an accident. Look, the guy nailed me, but it, it wasn't that. It didn't look like that bad because what he did was he uh, picked he he shoved this bumper down underneath and picked my truck up and yeah. So this is all dented. We popped that baby out, you know. So. I think it looks better with the, the dents, you know, it kind of kind of gives you some chuckles, you know what I'm saying? But really, you got to think about it. Are you really following Jesus this close? You know, have you given your life to Jesus Christ? Have you asked him to come in your life? Have you repented of your sins? Pretty easy, just takes a simple prayer. 
you have questions, want to get give your life to Jesus, just say say something. Say something in the comment box. Message me. You know how to get a hold of me, guys. Get a hold of me on Twitch. Get a, get a hold of me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, the website. So, anyway, hope you enjoy. Or maybe, I don't know. I would say I could flip that sign around, but um, now nah, I'm good. <laughs> I don't feel like going way back there, flipping it all around, but um, I would like to restore the saddle. It's an old saddle, um, but yeah, so hopefully you like, you like what I own. Uh, let me know if you want t-shirts. Oh, here, I'll show you some t-shirts. Now, uh, we're talking about Jesus t-shirts here, guys. Now, I did this when I was 20-something years old, so don't be laughing. Obviously, this is pink, so it's probably for a girl. And those are blank shirts, guys. <laughs> you guys want to buy blank pink shirts? All right, here we go. We got, let me just grab the thing here. All right. This is what it says. I starve my stomach to learn how to starve my eyes and mind. <clears throat> if you guys don't understand that, well... Think about starving your stomach, and then think about starving your eyes and mind. Obviously, we burn for lust. So, you know, I'm sure all of you guys have checked out a woman in the past years, or yesterday, or about two seconds ago. Maybe not two seconds ago, maybe like 12 minutes ago. <laughs> um, but anyway, you know, you gotta, you know, if you're trying to fight lust, you want to bounce your eyes, you want to get away from that stuff. So, you know, obviously I'm saying I starve my stomach to learn. I'm just trying to learn how to starve my eyes and mind and get away from that impurity, you know. Uh, that's one of the t-shirts. I got another one. I don't know where they're at. Let me look in here. Oh, come on now. Get in there, Sherlock Holmes. Uh... I got one for women and like uh, husbands and wives. Those are. Oh hey, check this out. I didn't finish. I want. I didn't. It didn't come out that well. But I was trying to. Um, I have a a bumper sticker I created. It's called "I'm a Thug." Um. Uh, Trading heart under God. That's what thug stands for. Or I'm a real thug. But I was trying to create, I got the, I was trying to get this guy to come out, um, make him look like a thug, you know? Like, kind of like, uh, when you think of a thug, you think of, I don't know, some gangster, you know? So, that's what I was trying to do, but then I was going to say, I'm a real thug, something like that, but that didn't come out too well. I'll probably finish one day. Uh, oh, here. Here's 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 the here's the wives. Are you guys are you women on fire? Do you guys have are you a wife? <laughs> so <clears throat> it says my husband is hot. You like that? I like I like the um the female version better than the the male version cuz you got the flowers. You see the little flowers there, you know? Oh yeah. And then obviously it says something on the back, eh, you know? All right, you remember my husband is hot. Ready? Oh, Jesus. You like that? <clears throat> you know, I could hook you up with t shirts for five bucks, you know? If you're interested. Uh, let me see if I can find a guy version. The guy version might be a little corny, I don't know. I know it's a white t shirt. Where they at? Where they at? I don't know. I haven't been. I like. I, these are all wrinkled. I mean, not wrinkled, but you know, not folded. You know what I'm saying? Um, I got things marked on here too. So, <clears throat> hold on. Let me put down the camera. How about that? You good with the camera, guys? You want to stare at the? I don't know. Maybe you can. Check me out or something. 
Oh, I think I'm... I don't know. The boxes are, are marked, but it doesn't mean they're... Oh, here we go. I got it. I found one, guys. So th this is the husband version. So if you're a husband, you know, and you, your wife's on fire for Jesus, you say, you know, you know what I'm saying? The reason why I say it's kind of corny, but whatever. It is what it is. You know what I'm saying? No, no, it's not what it is. All right, my wife is hot. You like that? You like the, like the fade there? You like, you know, hot? It's on fire, you know? All right, ready? Flip around. And obviously, it, you know, it says for Jesus. So and that's supposed to be like that, the fade. So yeah, guys. If you uh, if you like my shirts. Like I said, I mean, <clears throat> five bucks, you know, I don't know. Uh, or you can, you know, give a donation um, or whatever, you know, I can hook you up with, with whatever you want, you know. Um, you know, just let me know. So, all right, guys, hope you enjoy. Um, yeah, we can make this thing happen. If you want all, if you live in like China or something, you know, and you want one. Just pay the shipping and handling, I mean, um, yeah, you know, all right, thanks for hanging out here at my storage unit, we'll talk to you guys later. Go listen to some music. Yo, yo, yo.